Former Japanese Prime Minister Shinzo Abe has died from gunshot wounds sustained during a campaign speech in Nara, Japan on Friday morning. CNN reports that a spokesperson for Nara Medical University confirmed the tragic news in a press conference. Abe, who is Japan's longest serving Prime Minister, was officially pronounced dead at 5.03 p.m. local time. He was 67 years old. According to the Fire and Disaster Management Agency of the Ministry of Internal Affairs and Communications in Tokyo, Abe was shot in the right side of his neck at around 11.03 a.m. local time. Japan's public media organization, NHK, reports that he then collapsed and was immediately rushed to treatment. He reportedly had been struck by a bullet deep enough to reach his heart, and surgeons had found it impossible to stem the bleeding. NHK confirmed that police have arrested a 41-year-old man as the shooting suspect, adding that a handmade gun was discovered at the scene. The suspect reportedly lived in Nara City and once worked for Japan's Maritime Self-Defense Force. He allegedly told police that he was angry with the former prime minister and deliberately set out to kill him. Tributes from political leaders around the world have flooded in since Abe's death. The BBC reports that U.S. Secretary of State Antony Blinken said he was deeply saddened and deeply concerned by the shooting. French President Emmanuel Macron tweeted that he was deeply shocked by the heinous attack, and British Prime Minister Boris Johnson, who resigned on Thursday, tweeted that he was quote, Quote, utterly appalled and saddened to hear about the despicable attack, adding, my thoughts are with his family and loved ones. According to Business Insider, Japan has one of the lowest rates of gun deaths in the world. Abe served as Prime Minister of Japan from 2006 to 2007 and from 2012 to 2020.